Hello everybody, it's me Matteo and I'm here again with another CCO1 upgrade video. In my last video I showed you how I installed the lowering kit on my CCO1 chassis. In the meantime, I already tried it out and I have to say, the performance of the chassis on the street is very good. But the power of the standard 540 silver cam motor is a bit low for the streets. So I decided to install the Sidewinder 3 brushless combo from Castle. I use the combo with the 4600 kV motor and I use it with my 2S LiPo batteries. This is the motor and here you can see the controller. I strongly recommend to use full ball bearings in the chassis if you like to use a high power setup like this. I took out the old motor and now I install the motor plate and the pinion gear on the new motor. You have to be careful to install the motor plate on the position where the cables are on the top. Now I can install it in the chassis. But the lower screw here made it impossible to fix it correctly. The screw touching here on this position the lower part of the chassis. So I have to enlarge a bit this hole. For this work I use a Dremel. As you can see the hole is now big enough and from the underside of the chassis we can check if the screw fits in the opening. Now everything is good and I can install and screw on the gear cover. All the electronics are back in the chassis, but before I can test it, I have to do the calibration of the ESC, as it explained in the manual. Strangely, I had to change the direction of the second channel, the throttle, from normal to reverse, to have success with this calibration. We are ready now to test it. I'm very curious how it works and I think you too. So let's go outside and see how it performs. So we are here now outside and on my little test track. And everything turned on and we are ready now to test it. Okay, let's go. So, hope you like it, please give me a thumbs up and thanks for watching, see you next time.